I just want to make an observation quick about this whole Trinity thing of uh, this people defending this triune God Trinity second member of the God of the Trinity and all this other stuff you know the Bible says in Revelation chapter 22 for I testify unto every man that heareth the words of the prophecy of this book if any man shall add unto these things God shall add unto him the plagues that are written in this book and if any man shall take away from the words of the book of this prophecy, God shall take away his part out of the book of life and out of the holy city and from the things which are written in this book. Okay, the Bible ends with a warning about adding to or subtracting from. But 100 years, about 100 years after the Bible's finished, one day God the Father's up in heaven and God the Son's sitting over there on a beach chair and God the Holy Spirit's flying around and, and God the Son looks at God the Father and he says, you're upset about something, aren't you, Dad? And he said, yeah, son, I'm a little upset. What's going on? Well, you know, but nearly about 100 years ago, I got that Bible finished, and I put that thing in there about not adding to or subtracting from, but I forgot to say the word Trinity. And I forgot to say God the Son, and I got, forgot to say God the Spirit. And, son, you know, you're the second member of the Trinity. And, you know, and, and persons and all this other stuff that we know is true. What should we do? And God the Son, being the good Son that He is, He says, Daddy, it's okay. We got our Catholic Church down there to add these things to the Scriptures. And the Father says, Yeah, Son, but isn't that going to contradict? Don't worry about it, Son. Because, or don't, don't worry about it, Dad. <laughs> see how ridiculous this is? Don't worry about it, Dad, because you see, we know that tradition can trump Scripture. Isn't it absurd to actually have Christians that are saying, you know, it has to be the Trinity, the Trinity, the Trinity, the Trinity. You got a serious problem of sin. And I get called a sinner because I go against the Trinity. You got, you got some issues, those of you out there that defend this, this Trinity thing. But let's just give you the word Trinity, okay? We'll just, we'll just go along with the word Trinity, all right? Because it's so much clearer than Godhead, whatever. Let's just go along with that for a minute. But you got to create a whole bunch of other words to make your system work. It doesn't work. Okay? Please just stick to the King James Bible. Alright? 